when I first saw him, you could see that he had a lot of fear in his eyes. The shelter said, he's feral and aggressive. He can probably never live in a home. He was just brought in by someone. I knew I had to take him home or he wouldn't make it. He was just meowing, like this crazy loud meow. I brought him home and I brought the crate upstairs. And I was sitting there being quiet, offering him food, taking things really slow. Wanna try some pets? What do you think? I'm not gonna hurt you, promise. Can I try petting you? Eventually, I was able to give him that first little pet, and he just was so into it. He doesn't have front legs. I would imagine it was a hard life that he lived. Oh, my sweet boy. Let me see your little legs. Look at your little front legs. They're so little. He wasn't aggressive at all. He just needed someone to believe in him. He had mange and he was also pretty dirty, so I gave him a bath, warmed him up in a blanket. Thankfully, I have a guest bedroom that I was able to keep him in. I would sit in there for eight hours a day. I didn't really know what I was doing. It took a lot of time and a lot of patience getting there, making him feel comfortable. After a few days, he knew he was safe with me. Oh my god. It was almost like he was thanking me for, for pulling him out. When I first had him, he was so immobile. He wouldn't play with toys. Toys aren't your thing. You don't care. <laughs> he didn't want to do anything but lay there and get pets and cuddles. But then my cat Kitty Boy, he was super interested in meeting Joey. Kitty Boy wanted it so bad, and so he would meow outside the door all day. And Joey eventually started meowing back. Got really excited, and so I opened that door. Joey, I was like, shoot, who is this? What is this? <laughs> it's okay, Joey. Then slowly but surely you can see him evolve and be more interested in Kitty Boy. It got really funny because of this room having these little talking matches. Watching Kitty Boy play, Joe was like, yeah, I want to do that too. Eventually, he just wanted to be near Kitty Boy. For the first time ever, Kitty Boy and Joey cuddled. Kitty Boy had a lot to do with bringing out his personality. And turns out he's one of the quirkiest cats. Every week I see huge leaps of improvement. Come on. <laughs> that was so good. He's so fun and full of surprises. <laughs> he is the sweetest cuddliest cat I've ever met. All he wants is love all day, every day. More than capable of doing so many things. And he brings joy into every room he's in. And I just stare at him and I go, I can't believe you had a whole life that I don't know about and I can't imagine how difficult it was. And the fact that he has so much love to give and so much love that he's willing to receive is so special.